I just read that. <laughs> First of all, black people don't do that. Yeah, and we like that sound. Exactly, it's comforting. <laughs> it's like, hey, huh? Right. What the fuck are you talking about? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Chicks be chicken. <laughs> Full of cheese taken, be steakin. She swear she don't got a face. Listen, I'm on my Rihanna shit. I'm not dropping. <laughs> Just go check out Tip the Surgeon right now. Wait for the album. Carry. Wait for the project. No cap. For real, not real, just shit, wait for the project. That shit about to be fire. Fire emojis. Nah, mom, I know I got y'all, man. I'm cut. I'm just, I'm about to go on tour starting April 8th. So make sure y'all pop out. And that's just what it is. Go on my page. Check the flyers. Uh, uh. I'm going to bring mama out. I got Will to go juice. Got a few people, you know what I mean? Like, it's gonna be litty. So, just make sure y'all go check out the dates. Uh huh. Link in my bio. And we're going from there. Um, Buffalo in the house, period. Buffalo. What up, Buffalo? Oh, I heard you. Nah, the the girl that um, I really don't even want to speak on that too much because I really don't feel like it's that relevant. But like the girl that um got kicked out, I didn't even see her. So, <laughs> yeah, I also didn't see her. But like, we never seen her, so I don't even know if she was really there. So even if she was there. Of course, one of my homeboys kicked her out. Um, we had a strict, strict. dress code. It was strict. Even friends. So even friends couldn't come in with sneakers on. I told all my guys, I said, yo, if you coming in with sneaker, any type of sneaker. Yeah, because they was definitely trying to wear in. sneakers. And that was not Exactly. Fine. And I made sure they wore dress shoes. I told them that. That's friends. So, that like, I don't even know who this girl is. Like, I love all my supporters. Y'all know that. I love my fans. I love everything about them. You know what I mean? So, um, I didn't really care to speak on this because I knew exactly, like, what the situation was. I understand. I done been through controversy too many times to even dwell on anything. You just had it. I uh, um, I literally like don't care. Like I, I fuck with my supporters, fuck with my fans, but all the crying on camera and posting it on TikTok, it just made it seem like it was like something. And I don't. That's what I don't like understand. Like something disrespectful when really. Yeah, this when was really like, the whole time I didn't never just see dress you. Code. That's what it was. Like the same but way people restaurant. Do, yeah, I gotta understand. The same way Rock Nation brunch. You wasn't about to wear that there. Exactly. If Jay Z, yeah. Jay Z doing the Rock Nation brunch, and you came in there like on some that type of time, I don't think that was wrong with her outfit. I don't think that was wrong. Like I'm not saying there was something wrong with it. Yeah. It was just wasn't. It wasn't for the actual. Event. That event. event. That's all. Event. You know? That's like somebody coming with some sneakers on and we said the third. So I don't know how people making it seem, but that's not the situation. I didn't even care to speak on it. I th- Listen, I love all my supporters, all my fans, everything, man. I'm not that type of nigga, man. And y'all know that. So anybody that know that, know that. And I don't even like people making jokes about it. That's the crazy thing. Like, on top of that, I don't even like people making jokes about it. <laughs> Their feelings was hurt. Yeah. That's not nice. So, like, I wasn't I wasn't joking on her. Like, people saying Pilgrim and this, that, and the third and all this crazy stuff or whatever the case. Like, 
Listen, when people were sending it to me, I just looked at it and I just said, okay, like <laughs> she wasn't dressed to attire. And I didn't, I didn't have nothing to say against her. You know, and I didn't understand the crying. That's what the part I didn't get, the crying. <laughs> That's like us that one time going to that restaurant and we had um, Yeezy. Well, I had Yeezys on. And they, they exactly had, like, like you they, go to restaurants. You know, sometimes you, you go to restaurants. Hat, no tank tops. Yeah, we go to like restaurants. You can't go to certain places without dressing to attire. And like, what you gonna do? Cry? And make a video. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, I don't have nothing against Mama. God bless you. If I can meet you, you come on one of the shows one day. I'll hug you. I'm very humble. I didn't know you was there, mama. I didn't see you. I have my family there. Like, a lot of my family. My friends. Um, I got to be a, on point because I'm a celebrity. I got cameras in my face. You know, nobody knew that that happened, you know? So, it's just certain things you got to understand that celebrities go through. And then, like, you see people go viral because like like literally literally like somebody will make a video and like you know like go what? it's cause my shirt I need to take this shit off any <laughs> any damn way but um you know certain people will go viral to try to go viral just to get some type of attention. So you never know people intentions. You know what I mean? Like people want attention with intentions. And I never know. So it's like, you know, they'll say your name. They'll say, oh, the members of your team. So people will hear it and be like, oh, um, that's young and me, young and me. It don't matter about the team because at the end of the day, it still falls on young and me, you know. But my team did exactly what they were supposed to do. You know, like I don't, I don't think he probably was disrespectful. Yeah, it was no disrespect. It was never disrespect. It was just like you're not dressed appropriately, so you can't be here. That was just the rules and regulations at a party. And it applied to everybody. Everybody. Not, not, it not even applied to my person. niggas. Yeah. Like I even told them, you can't dress, no sneakers, no nothing. Like we we not doing that. You know, so. I love all people. If you don't know me, then you don't know me. I love all people. I don't care if you wear this, wear that. The rules and regulations always apply. If I seen you outside the party, I would have probably talked to you, hugged you, anything. I'm not that type of person. So, if you don't understand the assignment, that's on you. Yeah. But the fact that you made it a video on TikTok, cried, brung me up, brung the team up, means you was looking for clout. And to me, that's just, at the end of the day, you're not really a supporter. Because my supporters don't do that. That's it. And I ain't going to talk about it no more. She'll be all right. Yeah, yeah she'll so be all right. <laughs> Mm. Listen, she'll be all right. She'll be all right. She better stream to the surgeon, period. That's <laughs> it. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I probably look crazy right now because we just was on a long-ass flight for no reason because the damn airplane ran out of fuel and we had to stop in Virginia <laughs> for no reason. I just to the point where gas is becoming... <laughs> scarce even for the planes. For the planes. So, like, the gas for the planes is becoming bad. Like, it's crazy. Somebody said, yeah, she probably was trying to get my attention, but I wouldn't know. I'm here with, like, this is my birthday. Mm. How you make something about you on my birthday? That don't even make sense. You know what I mean? Like, it's my birthday, not yours. <laughs> so, like, obviously, I'm not going to pay a lot of people no mind on my birthday because people supposed to pay me mind. And then if you're not somebody I know, 
that's there, I wouldn't even notice you. I don't know. It's a lot of people. I ain't gonna lie. I'm mean as fuck. I'm really mean. Like, <laughs> and I don't mean mean in a way like I'm just like, 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 like a bully type mean. She's being I'm, her own world. I just really just don't acknowledge a lot of stuff. That's always been me. So, um, with that being the case, it's like, I got my family here. I'm happy to see my family. Mama, I didn't see you. I'm sorry. I apologize. Come to the shows, though. That's all. Just come to the shows. You could wear that fit. Yeah. I don't mind you wearing whatever you want to wear. Just come to the shows. That's it. Mm, that's it. And I'm done talking about it. Hey, what up? What? He drowned again. <laughs> you just had it. And I'm gonna let y'all know right now, boy. Like, my birthday's still not done. I literally just got back to the town, so now I'm about to be in New York, Jersey with it. So if y'all in the towns, pop out, cause now I'm finna really turn up. For real. We did Atlanta, filthy. You know what I mean? We did Atlanta, filthy. Every season in the fizzies. <clears throat> oh, is this 11 11? Mm hmm. I missed it. Somebody said, how old are you? I'm young. But I'm mature. That makes sense. Yeah, I used to live in VA too. That's a fact. I lived in I lived in VA for like nine years. Like VA is literally like my second home. I was born in Brooklyn, lived in Brooklyn for for years. Then I moved to 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 on um, VA. Then I moved to Georgia. I moved around. I don't know if y'all know. Like I lived in like I was born in New York, Brookdale Hospital to be exact. If y'all know, anybody from Brooklyn know the vibes. Then I moved to VA. And then I moved to Georgia for a year. And I moved back to Brooklyn when I was 16. And then ever since then, I've been, you know what I mean, New York, whatever. But yeah. Anybody that know that should know that. But if you don't know, now you know. But I'm Brooklyn's own. Mm-hmm. I've been to Haiti. I actually performed in Haiti. Go on YouTube, type in Young and May Haiti. I, I was actually, they said I was the first female rapper to perform in Haiti. I didn't even know that. I just was out there, like, showing love. Like, I love Haiti. I love all my Haitian. My little sister is Haitian. That's the crazy thing. Y'all don't even know that. My little sister is Haitian. She's half Haitian, like that is. My little sister is half Haitian.
But anyway, um, man, listen, man. Yeah, I click the link in my bio. Uh, I'll go check out that video. Tip the surgeon. Run it up, mob. I love y'all. I'm starting tour April 8th. And then I think it end like around May 7th or something like that. So I just need y'all to like tap in, man. Just go tap in. I am tired. Somebody say you look tired for I am tired. I'm tired because we had a long flight. I really didn't get no sleep. I've been partying for my birthday for the past. Not even just my birthday for my gang birthday here, Aries too. I'm finally home. Finally home. So I'm just relaxed in my bed. I just wanted to go live with y'all real quick. See what y'all was up to. But yes. I'm about to lay down with my girl. We about to watch some anything. <laughs> watch some anything. We about to watch some anything. My little baby. You know what I mean? And that's just what it is. You know what I mean? But definitely be outside. Just know my girl going to be with me on tour as well. Will going to be on tour with me. Will got the juice. He going to bring his girl. I got my son on um, Max. You already know Max. Max YB. That's my guy. You know what I mean? You already know he bringing that. So, that's the vibes. But right now, yeah, we all kind of tired because we had a long flight for no reason. And um, we cuddled up. So, I love y'all. just want to check in with y'all. Appreciate y'all. Thank you for supporting me. Click the link in my bio. Keep it G. Keep it me. Uh, I got a photo shoot in the morning. Literally. It's like the grind don't stop. So I just want y'all to know. Like, the grind don't stop, man. It's about to even get more crazy. So I told y'all when I take a break, I take a break for a reason because I'm already preparing shit. So that's the vibes. Right, so y'all, I mean, 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 I mean,